welcome back students today we are going to discuss the topic that is enzyme so let's start with this topic now enzymes are the catalyst for biochemical or you can say biological reactions that means catalyst is first of all what they are the molecules which accelerate or you can say increase the rate of reaction now enzymes are perform in the same function like they are the catalyst which bring about the rate of reaction you can say biochemical reaction in living cells so they are called as biocatalyst but they are proteinaceous in nature they lower the activation energy by increasing the rate of reaction the activity is lost if they are denatured they are the simple proteins and they may contain cofactors such as metal ions or organic vitamins which help in the activation of proteins next comes the name of enzymes no name of enzymes are decided on the basis of suffix added or you can say suffix is added to the enzymes and uh, depending upon the reacting substance or the function of enzyme the name is given now sucrase is an enzyme which reacts with sucrose lipase is an enzyme which reacts with lipids next comes the enzymes which can be named according to the function or which can be identified according to the function its physiological function first example for this is oxidase which catalyzes oxidation reaction oxidation reaction hydrolase catalyzes the hydrolysis reaction some of the common names of digestive enzymes are still, uh, used by adding suffix n example for this is pepsin or trypsin these enzymes does not you can say uh, indicate the substrate or the nature of reaction but some of them have now been changed next comes the classification of enzymes iub the international union of biochemists has classified all the enzymes into six classes the first is the oxidoreductase and the name itself says that reaction catalyzed by oxidoreductase is oxidation reduction next is transferases which catalyze the transfer of specific group or atoms next comes the hydrolases which catalyze the hydrolysis reaction or you can say catalyze the breakdown of large molecules into simple molecules by addition of water molecule next comes lyases in which addition or removal of atoms to form a double bond is done next comes the isomerases which catalyze the arrangement of atoms in a molecule to form isomers next comes the ligases which combine molecules using atp examples of classification of enzymes can be of oxidoreductases as i told you oxidases and reductases transferases is an example of transaminases which transfer amino group kinases which transfer phosphate groups hydrolases contains proteases and lipases proteases hydrolyze peptide bonds and lipase hydrolyze lipid ester bonds next lyases in which examples are carbo carboxylases and hydrolases in which addition of co2 and addition of h2o is brought about next example is of isomerases enzyme isomerases an example of enzyme isomerase okay next ligases next enzyme is ligases example for this is rubp carboxylase now this enzyme catalyzes the joining of rubp enzyme uh, rubp and carbon dioxide in photosynthetic fixation by hydrolysis of atp so students in this session we have seen an introduction about enzyme in further session we will have a more detailed look on enzymes thank you